Okay, third time's the charm, right? <laughs> third, third attempt here. This is the mudroom we're looking at, somewhat. Let me see if I can zoom out. No, that's the door to the house. Okay, so this will be the stairs down to there. They'll be landing and then going there. This is, of course, the rim joist, so all the floor joists are there at this level. These are just boards that are on the outside. There's the foundation. The foundation is... There's a footer, one, two, and a third block up underneath this level. So, water heater's up here. There's the pipes for that. You can see some of the metal I've driven in there. That's a got a foundation under three blocks up, and it's uh, or four, four blocks I think. It's just uh, something I paid a guy to put in, but it'll, it'll be the it'll be like a 32 inch doorway here. So. Um, so this will be gone. There'll be stairs that are this wide from here to there, basically, over there somewhere. So, like two feet wide or something. Right here is where I cut out. I cut from, yeah, yeah, my feet are in the way. From that corner to here, you know, you can see where I broke it out there, that corner. Over there, you can see my cuts. And then back here, this section here. This opening was already here for uh, access to the basement. And actually, I cut over here. You can see they, they didn't have any smooth cuts before, so that bumpy stuff is where... Yeah, anyway, whatever. So, this part is the part I broke out by trying to pry the metal out that was down there. This piece of metal, you see the sand still sticking. It was actually up to here, but this is where the pressure got too high for it or whatever. Too much, so... Then uh, my cuts are here, and one is here, and you can see there's a crack, maybe, going over to there. Yeah, you can see that, I think hard there's the other crack going over there and there's a seam here where they put the two they poured it in at least two well there's a seam over there so there's three that made it easier to do it in little bits and pieces so like I say this metal and other ones were down there to the corner I didn't have any metal over there yet but I pulled them all out uh, they were because mainly because they were sitting at an angle like this instead of straight up and down so yeah I'll have to cut some of this out for the stairway this metal and probably some of that block there the steps will be too low at that point and a lot of that dirt has to come out down there but first I want to put the wall here of pieces probably this wide eight or ten inches wide um, I'll have to put you know put a metal make a metal brace type thing bar or whatever to go underneath the concrete from over here to over there because this piece isn't reliable and I'll probably just take it out then I could backfill through that area and have all those Metal, corrugated metal pieces going down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, how many ever weld them all together. So there's the view from here. That, of course, is the basement down there. You can see my chimney over there. Wood for the wood stove, which is right there. And uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, so planning to put a stairway here. Starting over here, I'll cut this out, this, this mudroom slab, and go down to there, and then turn and go in stairs going down as you go obviously okay so that's a general overview i think that helps maybe a little bit to see what's going on there uh all right i'll see ya